nga blafomi ke acha obiope dibli la mo na obio jevia lili li kami me cha cha bi tete pak pako ando nyamche nana adodan kwa ekufu adu wake mohe mohe taba ada asavotu fiami festival wawe msa ne ahiono ke ejo oba kenima kake sewa hemo kenima enyu nene ada ke ye ni meli ke si ba mi nye ba mi du oketechi oketechi prekese jane nana adodan kwa ekufu adu prekese jane nana adodan kwa ekufu adu nukrenye Oye ko kromoti ampa ebe mose dade bo ana denche bo welcome 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 his excellency nana adodan kwa ekufu adu to ada asapotu fiam festival a festival that shines in the cold like a first prize brass band swinging along the streets of pompo Asalemano, leno pinya, en aple ne ahi. Now to the king, sure and very optimistic. Impossible free SHS, made possible. You are the father of all possibilities. One district, one factory. One district, one factory. A confirmation. You are the solution to Galamse and many more. I'm very happy to be here today to join you to celebrate this year's Asafu Tufiami Festival. Ever since the, the Ghanaian people, by the grace of God, voted for me to become President of the Republic, this is the very first festival I'm attending in the greater Accra region. So like you, this day will always remain etched in my memory. I'll not forget this day. My presence here is not only to join you to celebrate this festival, but also to serve the purpose of strengthening the cordial relations existing between the chiefs and people of the Adna traditional area and the MPP government. Traditionally, my party, the new patriotic party, has not done well in Adna. But having heard the warmth of the response of the people, I'm hopeful of a new future. I'm determined that my government will work to convince you we deserve your love and support. We want to bring progress and prosperity to all parts of the country in a balanced, inclusive development of the Ghanaian nation. Mobilizing our country's resources has meant that we have beginning, we began rolling out our flagship policy initiatives like the One District, One Factory Project and the Program for Planting for Food and Jobs. The implementation of the One District, One Factory Policy has meant that 636 factories are at various stages of being operationalized, which will create thousands of direct and indirect jobs. The Lankiani Soil Milk Factory, located in Asutuari, Ishai Usudoku, has been inaugurated and is fully functional. I would urge the Ada East and West District Assemblies, as well as the Ada Traditional Council, to develop a plan towards exploiting the vast potentials of the area to ensure residents benefit from their local resources. The Songo Lagoon, for example, about which a passionate appeal has been made to me, has the potential to produce salt in large scale and commercial quantities from its current status. Government is collaborating with all relevant stakeholders to ensure that at long last, the necessary investment is secured for its development into a modern salt industry. 
The successful implementation of this project will create employment for lots of people and generate the much needed revenue for development. Nene Abram Kabu Akwaku the third, ladies and gentlemen, a key challenge of our economies, like many other economies in Africa, is its infrastructural deficit. We are embarking on an aggressive public-private partnership program to attract investment in the development of both our rail and railway infrastructure. We are hopeful that with solid private sector participation, we can develop a modern railway network with strong production center linkages and with the potential to connect us to our neighbors to the north, i.e. Burkina Faso, to the west, i.e. Côte d'Ivoire, and to the east, i.e. Togo. Nonetheless, the Minister for Roads and Highways, Honorable Kwesia Mwakwata, MP for Atiwa West, has informed me that the roads in the Ada area are receiving his undivided and attention and work on all abundant projects will commence again very, very soon. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I need the support of all of you, whether you voted for me or not, whether you supported my party or not, to achieve this goal. In the period of my mandate, I would need your support so that together we can rebuild Ghana and let the black star shine and shine again. May God bless the people of Ada and us all. And may God bless our homeland Ghana and make her great and strong.